Coming up, part one of the Williams Conventional to TMCC with Electric Railroad's Cruise Commander Board. Hey, welcome back. Hope everybody's doing okay, like always. Try to take this time to thank all my subscribers. Those that leave a comments, truly appreciate it. So here's the William F7. That I'm going to be converting over to TMCC with the ERR Electric Railroad's command module and uh, F7 series sound card. This is a Williams, basically a generic or conventional with sound. That's about it with the old uh, light bulb. I'm gonna be converting it to LED and making it run a lot nicer with TMCC as I've done with my other uh, engines basically just took everything apart there's screws here for the weight and there's only two screws here two screws, two screws there and uh, she pops right out turning it around you're gonna see that you're gonna have a screw here that's gonna be holding the speaker and then a screw here that's gonna be holding the actual board it's got a ground in each motor, which I'll be taking those apart. Now I've taken off the, the board. You see everything is connected with wires. Now, if you're like me, you'll forget where everything goes. That's why I like the video, take a lot of pictures and um, and make sure everything is right. So what the first thing I do is I mark, cause I'm not gonna cut anything. So I could use this board or sell it or do whatever. And what I do is I'm gonna mark on the engines and the motors, the colors. So these are blues, I turn it around and this way will be yellow. And then uh, on the solder here and here and um, have everything together. Turn my trusty old on, soldering gun. And I'm going to peel back these black. insulation that Williams has put on these motors. Let's peel them back. Because I want to use new wiring. Now you could just cut everything off, but I, I like to keep the whole boards intact. Okay, I could reuse them and another engine. I could put this whole system in a conventional engine and I'll have a conventional engine with sound. I got the old trusty ironing, uh, soldering iron, soldering board, soldering gun. And I'll just um, unsolder that one. I'm sorry, that one, put this back. I have these, um, just slide these out. Turn it around. Do the same thing to the other side.
And there we go. I'll go ahead and unscrew the positive. Yeah, take these little screws out because then the other one will be easier to take out. These little nuts. Why they put the screw on the inside, I'll never know. They make things more difficult than they need to be. Because whoever has a screwdriver that's that small to fit back there. box and there she is and I'll do the same thing here I'll cut strip and unsolder And unsolder that, and that's basically it. The board is out. Now you just put it away in a little plastic bag, and she's ready to to rock and roll. So there she is. She's all done. Put everything in the bag. I'll label it with a little sticker what it is. And um, I could reuse it for another engine or or just sell it or do whatever. And she's ready. The wires for the common, or for the positive. The negatives go here, which I use, I won't, <clears throat> I won't use, um, I won't use these screws. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna solder them a lot better and uh, I won't use these screws I'll solder everything well there she is in part two we're gonna go ahead with the installation of the board happy railroading bye